I want to now begin with how do you get to that place of healing the wounds that are in your soul from arguments, contention, hostile environments, to childhood traumas, to marriages that have failed, to engagements that may have failed, to uh, work, office tension, to uh, being hurt by someone in the church, unfortunately. We're not to do that, but those things happen, and that doesn't mean that that person is awful. It just means that they need prayer, and you do too. You have to ask God to heal you, and you must forgive them. So let's go to the Word always. It is always the Word. The answers are in the Holy Word, the Holy Bible. And we must forgive. We must first forgive before we do any praying and asking God to heal we, anyone for our healing. We must forgive the person if, the, if anyone had anything to do with this sickness or wounds. And we must just ask God to, forg- to forgive us of our sins. So we, in the first book of John, chapter 1, verse 9, it says that when we confess our sins, the Lord is fair and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us of all unrighteousness. So first, when you pray, you ask God to forgive you of your sins. You ask thy Lord to, you, you're transparent with him. Don't hide because he's Jehovah Roi. He sees all. He wonderfully and fearfully made us. He has all our tears that have hurt us in his bottle. He's concerned about you, beloved one. He loves you. He wants you to be free. You cannot keep this from him. He knows. You can pretend with me. You can pretend with others. But he knows where that first scratch is. He knows the very hairs the number of the hairs we have on our head. He knows. He knows. So cast your cares upon him and he will sustain you. Give him this pain that's hurting and paralyzing you for some. Give him this hurt. Give him the offense from the hurt. Give him the rejection from the hurt. Give it to your father and he will sustain you forgive go into prayer and ask the lord to forgive you of your sins and then you ask him to forgive and then you forgive those that have hurt you and when you forgive them release what they've done keep no record of the wrongdoing that has been done to you this is not easy I'm not saying it is easy. It isn't easy. The Lord has helped me in this area. I have had to ask him for grace in this area. I have been wounded in the past, very much so. And so I have had to ask the Lord, Lord, give me grace to forgive. Give me grace to let go. Give me grace to not keep rehearsing what they've done. Give me, Lord, grace not to keep a list of what they have done. We want thy Lord to be merciful unto us. Well, if that is true and we need his mercy, we must also be merciful toward our enemies. 